Yo, what up? Welcome back. Today we look at Josh Minot, a four-star wing out of Florida. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to help grow the channel. I hope you enjoy the video. Quick shout out to Memphis fan K Steez for the request. I have several projects lined up, but if you guys want a particular breakdown, just let me know and I'll throw it in the mix. The 6'9", 190 pound wing out of Boca Raton, Florida is the number 29 rated player in the country and the seventh ranked small forward. His player comp is going to be former five star and current NBA wing Darius Baisley, tall and slender wings who can do a multitude of things on both ends. Can contest any shot, can finish at the rim, bring the ball up the court, play both roles in the pick and roll. His athleticism helps him in multiple ways. As you can see, on top of being versatile, he has elite length. This helps him contest shots from small, quicker guards, but also bigger and stronger players who create space with their bodies. Those are just some of his measurables. He's quick to the ball and quick off the floor. Pretty underrated bounciness once you watch him play. He doesn't look explosive, then he switches gears and shows impressive ability to get off the floor. He's impressive in transition as well in his ability to get up and down the court, sprinting his lanes on the wing, or even when he's handling the ball with his eyes up, blowing past defenders. His shooting ability is pretty interesting. Uh, at 6'9", he's definitely a capable shooter. It can hit multiple threes in games and even hurt defenses from mid-range. Even off the dribble, I mean, quick handle right into his jump shot. Uh, but his shooting form isn't very conventional. Shoots the ball offline in front of his face, and his elbow comes out quite a bit. I wonder if they're going to tweak this before he gets to college, or even when he gets to college, especially like during the summertime, uh, if the staff tries to tweak his shot just a little bit. I only say that because he's fine in spot-up situations, but when he has to shoot off the dribble going left or right, it's tough to get his shot lined up based on his balance and his shooting form when his momentum is, isn't carrying towards the rim. His driving and playmaking is what gives me a lot of hope for his pro future. This is what will separate him. He has such a quick, strong, and confident handle for a kid who's 6'9", and probably still growing if you look at his body type. He can attack going to his right or to his left, and then uses his quick bounce and length to get to the rim fairly easy. Not only can he finish well off the bounce and get to the rim, he's an unselfish player who is always looking up for teammates. He attracts so much attention by being the best player on the court. He does a great job finding guys sprinting up the lanes or cutting to the rim in the half court for an easy lay-in. Back in July, he set a final list of Baylor, Florida State, Maryland, Memphis, and Texas. On August 8th, he decided on Penny Hardaway in Memphis. Overall, he's a versatile wing, capable of playing multiple positions. I look forward to him improving over his senior year and taking his game to another level once he gets on campus. Dan Dockage. Can't guard me.